On this Memorial Day, we pause to remember all those who gave their lives in wars and other hostilities, as well as all our beloved dead. These are our mothers and fathers, sons and daughters, our brothers and sisters, and members of our family and friends who have gone to their rest in the Lord. May our prayers today call upon God, our Almighty Father, who raised Jesus, his Son, from the dead for the salvation of both the living and the dead. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace and peace of God our Father, who raised Jesus from the dead, be with you always. And with your spirit. My dear friends in Christ, we gathered on this Memorial Day to pray for our brothers and sisters whose bodies rest in St. Joseph, Holy Trinity Slovak, and St. Stanislaus Cemeteries. They have passed from death to life in company with the Lord Jesus, who died and rose to new life, and are purified now of their faults. We pray that God may welcome them among all the saints in his heavenly kingdom. Brothers and sisters, listen to the words of the first letter of St. Paul to the Thessalonians. We do not want you to be unaware, brothers and sisters, about those who have fallen asleep, so that you may not grieve like the rest who have no hope. For if we believe that Jesus died and rose, so too will God, through Jesus, bring with him those who have fallen asleep. Indeed, we tell you this on the word of the Lord, that we who are alive, who are left until the coming of the Lord, will surely not precede those who have fallen asleep. For the Lord himself, with a word of command, with the voice of an archangel and the trumpet of God, will come down from heaven, and the dead in Christ will rise first. Then we who are alive, who are left, will be caught up together with them in the clouds to meet the Lord in the air. Thus, we shall always be with the Lord. Therefore, console one another with these words. The word of the Lord. 
Thanks be to God.
same perpetual simplicity. Saint Agnes, Saint Gregory, Saint Augustine, all you holy men and women, pray for them. Saint Athanasius. Saint Basil, Saint Martin, Saint Benedict, Saint Francis and Saint Dominic, Saint Francis Xavier, Saint John Vianney. Saint Catherine of Siena, all you holy men and women, pray for them. Saint Teresa of Jesus, Saint Stanislaw. Saint John Newman, Saint Catherine Drexel, Saint Juan Diego, Saint John the Twenty Third, Saint Paul the Sixth, Saint John Paul the Second, Saint Catherine of Calcutta. By their outpouring. With Christ, there is mercy and fullness of redemption. Let us now pray as Jesus taught us. Our Father, Our day. 
into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Let us pray. All powerful God, whose mercy is never withheld from those who call upon you in hope. Look kindly on your servants at rest in St. Joseph, Holy Trinity, Slovak, St. Stanislaus Parish Cemeteries, who departed from this life confessing your name, and number them among your saints forevermore. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. 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 Eternal rest grant unto them, O Lord, and let perpetual light shine upon them. May they rest in peace. Amen. May their souls and the souls of all the faithful departed through the mercy of God rest in peace. Amen. Bow your heads and pray for God's blessing. May the love of God 
and the peace of the Lord Jesus Christ bless and console us and gently wipe every tear from our eyes. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Go in the peace of Christ. Thanks be to God. While the storm clouds gather far across the sea, let us wear the night.